And Dothan, quick thinking from a crew from Pilcher's Ambulance Service, saving a homeowner this weekend from an inferno and, quite frankly, his inevitable death. Tonight, our Sarah Drake joins us live from the scene on South Foster with more. Sarah, good evening. Yeah, good evening, Ben. I'm standing outside of the house that was on fire this weekend here on Foster Street. And I actually want to step out to give you guys a look at the house. As you can see, the fire department has put up that do not cross tape all around the home, as well as the roof has actually caved into the inside of this home. And there is still a smoky smell here in the air. And had it not been for the two Pilcher Ambulance Service crew members passing by on their way to another call, this man may not be alive today. On their way to a medical call, Pilcher's Ambulance Service crew Shanda Sanders and Michael Mixon unexpectedly took measures to save another life. We saw a smoke, actually, a whole lot of smoke. So we ended up stopping, and I noticed the door was locked from the inside. So I started walking around knocking on the windows. I went around to the left side, and that's where I saw the flames. At the scene, Sanders said she could hear a television inside the home. She and her partner guided firefighters to where they thought a person may be inside. Shanda, she saw where the fire had breached the, the house on the back corner. <laughs> Called into the fire department, told the fire department where the TV was running at. When they got there, they went right in the front door and, and found the occupant in there. The timing of the crew was pivotal in saving the man's life as the inhalation alone could have eventually killed him. I'm glad that we were able to you know, notify fire to hurry up and get in there because I don't, I don't know how long you would have made it, to be honest. I've been a firefighter 31 years and I've always preached to all my guys every day about situational awareness. The smoke was something that's not supposed to be there. That made me aware. Practice what I preach. Both Sanders and Mixon tell me that being able to help people every day means a lot to them. And both Mixon and Sanders tells me it's important for them to have a good working relationship with the Dothan Fire Department in situations such as this one because it's important to trust who you're working with. Re reporting live in Dothan, Sarah Drake, WDHN News 18. Ben. Some genuine heroics here on this Oh, point. definitely. Like it was uh, very impressive. Those unsung heroes, basically. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, all right, so school year winding down. 